Oh, you cannot hear. Okay, it's muted. Sorry about that. All right, thank you so much for joining the live streaming. <laughs> I will start again. <laughs> Sunday live streaming at K Yo. Rachel, have fun with your family. That's more important. Enjoy spending time with your family. Hi, Buya. Chibi. Hello, Francesca. Ocean discovery. Fun, right? <laughs> Brushing teeth and studying. You're a multitasker. Hello, Jess. Um, Enkita Day. Hello. Jess can hear. Now you can hear. Hello, Nikki. Thanks for popping by. Yeah. All right. Muktasha, hello. Satria, oremaniyo. Thank you so much for the uh, joining the live streaming today. Today is Sunday, so we're gonna finish off the webtoon series Yoshin Gangming. So yesterday we had live streaming about episode seven from Yoshin Gangnim True Beauty. So I don't know if you remember. So they bump into each other in the bookstore and she was hoping that he wouldn't recognize her and she recommended some kind of books to him. And now we're gonna study about the next day, what happens. Okay? So she's gonna see if he can recognize her at school because they go to the same school, right? So episode 7 part 2. Okay, so this is a highly interactive learning. Please have your pen, paper, and dictionary ready because if you engage more so with the live chat and type whatever I'm asking, that's going to help you to remember what you're learning. So I highly encourage you to do that. So we're going to go to our study board. So this is the next day. Okay, and subject is orange color, object pink, Verb blue, this is miscellaneous work. So we're going to go through each word at a time. So if I'm reading too fast or explaining too fast, please let me know at any time because we are all here to learn together. Hi Tiffany, thank you. Thanks for joining the live streaming. Hopefully you caught up though. So all right, 다음 날 next day so back to school oh he's just passing by she's like oh isuho that's the guy's name right <laughs> look at her like looks angry right or angry or almost happy so here 날못 알아본다 이거지 That's just laughing sound. Okay. And then, 날 못 알아본다 이거지. 날, this is object, right? 나 plus R, object particle. 못 알아본다 이거지. So this is the verb that we learned yesterday, 알아보다. So this is all about people recognizing another. So I just said it, yeah, to recognize. 알아보다, to recognize, 본다 이거지. This is something that I had, uh, I had to really think before this live streaming. It's almost like, oh, you won't recognize me. Is that right? Type thing. Is that right? Almost like talking to yourself, realizing something. Hi, interesting. You won't recognize me. Is that right? Type thing. It's hard to explain what it is. If I break it down though, 이거 is this thing. This thing, or you can interpret it as this. Besides you use object. G is ending as confirmation. 
So think of it as, is that right? Oh, is this? Is this that he won't recognize me? Am I explaining clear enough? I know it's not really a clear cut though, right? So you have to kind of understand the context. And here, mot, this is can't. Use the before verb. So, he can't recognize me. And he, she seems a little happy, you know, like, oh, that's good. And now she's confident to approach him. Oh, so annyeong, right? So annyeong, oh, hey. And this is like, uh, this is more like a slang word, saying, if you type saying in neighbor, oh, is that it? I like that. Is that it? Yeah. 네, 뿌야씨. 네, I like is that it. Um, saying is like slang. If you look up saying, probably it's not going to give you that much. Saying, 까다. Normally, they're used together. Senkada. Have you ever heard this expression? Oh, I see. I thought you're calling me. <laughs> so you don't you don't call me Sen. <laughs> yeah, Senkada. This is like ignore someone. Oh yeah, no Senkanya. Are you ignoring me? Senkada. So this one saying, as you can see, saying is he's just passing by, ignoring her as if no one's there. Okay. <웃음> 우 아니 저 부르장머리를 사람이 인사하는데 왜? 우 아니. So 아니. This one is like interjection. We know, ani is no, right? No, but as an interjection, has different meaning, depends on the context. In this case, I feel like, wait a minute, wait a minute, right? Ani, 저 부르장머리를, so that what? You may not be able to find it, because this is written in incorrectly. 버르장머리 is correct way. Normally in webtoon, they're gonna kind of switch the consonant or vowel and things like that to make it fun. So they intend to do it. 버르장머리. If you look that up in neighbor dictionary, you may be able to find meaning. So 버르장머리 없다. Normally we use this verb together. 버르장머리 없다. So there is no something, right? 버르장머리 This is like manners. You have no manners. But it's not about somebody who just doesn't have etiquette. It's more like you haven't been taught or you're spoiled. You behave wrongly with bad habits because you haven't been taught. 버르장머리 없다. Normally, older people will take young kids. You are spoiled brat. 버르장머리 없어. Right? <laughs> that helps learning. Yeah, that's <laughs> Yeah. 버르장머리 없다. So, she's also saying the same thing. 저 부르장머리. It's in that bad manner. 아니, 사람이 인사를 하는데 예의 is also manner. Or politeness. Yay. Mm -hmm. 사람이 인사를 하는데 Subject particle 인사를 하는데 인사를 Object particle 하는데 는데 ending Just open conversation Or it could be but 사람이 사람 means Me I No human This person or any human, what? Do, 인사. 
But why is he just going by? Who would do that? Think of it as who does that? 아니 사람이 인사를 하는데 person does what? 인사 greeting, right? person does greeting person says hi but he just goes by, right? who does that? okay so now we move on to the next part so by the way, we have eight sections to go through today. So this is the second part. <웃음> 어, 어 잠깐, 수야, 어내 인사 못 들었어? 네? 잠깐, 수야, hey. When we call out somebody, we say 수야, 수야, right? Hey, 수. But 잠깐 first, 잠깐 is as you can see in the uh, picture. Wait, 잠깐. Sometimes you're gonna see it as 잠깐만. Only a little moment, 잠깐 or 잠깐만. They're the same thing. 잠깐, wait, stand there or uh, stop there, right? In English, people will say stop there. Hey. 수호야, 내 인사 못 들었어? 내 인사 못 들었어. So this is the same thing. My greeting couldn't what? What's the verb here? Dictionary form from 들었어. Hello, welcome to the live chat. To here. But what is the dictionary form? 들었어. This is actually 듣다. 듣다 becomes 들어요. And this is becoming past tense, right? 들었어. So either to listen to or to hear, you need an object. I made a video about this specific verb. Differentiating with 들리다. If you want to check that out later, please do so. So this verb needs an object. So did you, could you not hear my greeting? Hey, oh, she's there to ask him. Oh, wait. Did you not hear me saying hi? And 작업. <laughs> 작업. Didn't finish the verb. It's actually the verb from 차갑다. What's that mean? 차갑다. Scary? Scary is 무섭다. This is to be scary. 무섭다. This is 차갑다. To be cold. He is so cold. Doesn't show any warmth. 차갑. Cold. 뭔데? 뭔데? 앤데? So, open conversation, 뭐? It's so what? So, think of it as, what's up? What is it? Trying to find out, okay, why did you call me? What is it? 뭔데? And, she is? <laughs> 아, 알겠나, 알겠어. 뭐, 뭐냐니, 지난주 카페에서 같이 일본어 공부했던 김, 임주경인데 기억 안 나? <웃음> oh, I see. <웃음> 알겠네, 알겠어. So normally when you see two verbs together, sometimes we have a ne on the first verb. It's just repetition. Korean people like to repeat verbs. 알겠네, 알겠어. It's like how cold. Okay? So, 알다 verb is actually what? And get is will, right? I will what? So, look up this verb, 알다. 알다. To be frozen. To be frozen. So, who's gonna be frozen? 
I, I will be frozen because of your coldness. You're so cold. So I will be frozen. She's almost joking. I'll be frozen because of you. 아, 알겠네, 알겠어. 에? 뭐 뭐냐니? 지난주 카페에서 같이 일본어 공부했던 임주경인데 기억 안 나? 뭐 뭐냐니? 뭐 뭐냐니? So this one, I think it's from 냐고하니. It could be separated to 냐고하니. So asking back, when you're asking back, 뭐냐니? What is what? Think of it as, what is what? 뭐냐니? What do you mean by that, right? Yeah, that's right. 뭐냐니? Asking back. 지난주? 지난주? Quoting a question. Oh. 레이첼, did you change your, um, the uh, icon? Your picture looks different, it seems. 지난주, last week. 카페에서. Oh, I see. 카페에서. So, box star, where they met and studied Japanese. 카페, it's the same thing as English word. 에서, location particle, at that cafe. 같이. So I pronounce it as chi sound, right? You don't say kati. You say kachi. What's that? Kachi ilbona gongbu hetta. Ilbona gongbu hetta. This is an adjective describing imjugyong. Oh, imjugyong is her name, right? That's right. 같이 is together. Together, 일본어. 일본 is Japan. 어 means language. Right? So, Japanese. 일본어. 한국어. Korean language. 공부했던. This is the verb from 공부하다. 우리는 지금 한국어를 공부하고 있어요. We are studying Korean. Right? 공부하다. So that becomes 공부했. Past tense and done is also past tense adjective. We had studied or we used to study but it sounds better in this case. We had studied. 임주경. Oh, that girl, 임주경. Who had studied Japanese together at the cafe last week? In the beaver with either but or open conversation. I'm the girl in Jugyeong, right? 기억 안 나? 기억 안 나. So this is all cling together, but technically 기억 나다. This is the verb. This is a verb, but this is, can be a noun. 기억. And nada can be a verb, but when they're together, could be one verb as well. That's why the negation, an, is split into, in between, noun and the verb. 기억 is memory. Nada appear, memory appears. That means what? 기억나다. Memory doesn't come up. Yeah, that's right. Remember. So 기억나다 means remember. 기억나? Oh, do you remember? 기억안나? Do you not remember me? Why? 뭐냐니? 지난주 카페에서 같이 일본어 공부했던 임주경인데 기억안나? You know, this is Im Jugyeong who had studied Japanese together at the cafe last week. Do you not remember me, right? So, she is surprised. Because she thought that at least he would remember her. 
with the maker, right? Because they studied together. Hmm. Ah, 그랬나? Ah, 그랬나라니? 그랬나. Hmm is the same thing. Hmm. Thinking. Ah, 그랬나? 그랬나? Okay. This 그랬나? This is like 그렇다 with past tense and 나. This is, think of it as a re recollection, recalling about what happened. Oh, did that happen? Was it? So kind of like a, think of it as a, was it? Did that happen? 기억나다. 나타났다. Oh, I see. Oh, is that so? Okay. So, pretty much it's like he doesn't remember. Oh, was that it? Was that? I don't remember. And she is saying, 아, 그랬나라니? She is quoting him, this one. Same thing. 라니. 그랬나? 라니. So she's upset. So I think this is like lago honey. 그랬나 lago honey. Are you saying? Are you saying 그랬나? Are you seriously saying 그랬나? I'm gonna find that if we actually gone through lani before. Lani. Yeah, I don't think we have done that. I think this is like not believing. Do you guys uh, have any better ex uh, explanation for that? <laughs> 그랬나라고 하니. So are you saying 그랬나? Not believing. And then 아참. 아무튼 스터디 애들 중에 네 번호만 없어서. <laughs> She's sweating. She's sweating. A ah, cham. Cham has different meaning. Cham, we learned it as an adverb, genuinely, right? Cham ipuda. Oh, she's genuinely very pretty. In this case, sentence, beginning of the sentence interjection. A ah, cham. Oh, I forgot to say. A ah, cham, I forgot to say. All right. Amten study 애들 중에 네 번호만 없어서. Amten is the same thing as 어쨌든. 아무튼 is shorten to amten. 어쨌든. Amten 어쨌든. Anyway, right? In any case, study. Mm-hmm. Study edu junge. Study edu junge. So study, this is the same thing as study. Edu. Kids, right? But you can think of it as guys. Study people. Friends who we study together, right? So study kids junge. Jung has a meaning of middle. Jung. Study group people. Think of it. Or in the middle. Oh. You can think of it as in the middle, but in this context, you can also associate to among. Mm -hmm. Among study group kids. Among study group Friends, you can think of it as friends. 네 번호만 없어서. 네 번호만. 만 없어서. I used subject because 없다 verb cannot have an object. So, 없다. Conjugated to 없어, right? And then 서 is conjunction. 네 번호만 없어서. 네 
I pronounce it as ni even though it's written as ne because when you're actually saying it, it sounds like the same thing as ne. So even though it's written as ne, when people say in speaking format, people usually say ni. Okay? Ni. Ni ponoman. Your number. Only your number 없어서. 없다 verb don't have. I don't have only your number among study group people. Oh, it's a pickup line. <laughs> this is a pickup line from this girl. Oh, I need your number. So, this is conjunction. Because. Right? Oh, oh, wait. Oh, I forgot to say. Oh, so she's almost justified. I'm asking this because I don't have only your number among study group guys. Anyway. Wow. 알려줄 수 있어? 알려주다 with 알수 있어. So verb root plus 알수 있다. If the verb root ends with a consonant, you're gonna use 을수 있다. Oh, you cannot see. 을. Okay. So, can you? 알리다 is inform. So, the verb here is 알리다 plus 주다. So, 알리다 means to inform. Judah is a favor. So can you inform me as a favor? Because I don't have only your number. Oh, so it's like, can you give me your number? <laughs> That's funny. I thought that she kind of wanted to avoid him. But now she's like asking him his number. That's interesting. Ha <laughs> He's not satisfied. What is, what's up this girl? What's wrong with her? And then he's saying, she's smooth. <laughs> 표정 보소. I think this is what she's thinking. 표정 보소. 표정. The author wrote them all together. I think it's 표정 보다. Verb and 소 is just verb ending. 표정 보소. So ending, verb ending is usually used in a traditional speech format. 표정 보소, you know, expression, look. 보다 verb, right? So look, look at that expression. Look at his face. He's so upset, right? 표정 보소. But I'm still surprised that she asked him phone number. Maybe she likes him. Hmm. So tok 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 tok. Like she's uh, uh he's uh, writing down his number and then cha. So this cha syllable I guess has a lot of meanings. I keep finding more meanings. Normally verb root cha. This is what let. And we also learned as cha as an interjection before. Introducing a topic. 자. 자. 그럼. Now. Right? But in this case, it's neither. It means here. 자. Here. Here you go. But you're not gonna say this to older person. This is casual speech. 자. Hey. Here. Okay. <laughs> and then. 꼭 필요한 거 아니면 연락하지 마. 꼭 필요한 거 아니면, wow, you know, bad guys, right? 꼭 필요한 거 아니면 연락하지 마. So you see a conjunction there. This sentence has conjunction, meaning two clauses are connected to the conjunction. And 꼭 means definitely, definitely, right? 
So conjunction here is 면. 아니면, if not. Okay, if not. 꼭 필요한 거 아니, 아니면. 필요한 거. The things that you need. Meaning, really important things. 필요한 거, 꼭 필요한 거. Things that you definitely need. Or vital matters. 아니면, 연락하지 마. If not, 연락하지 마. Contact, 지마 ending, don't. Don't contact me. So this one, if I say, don't contact me, if not, it's something that you really need, right? So you can think of it as unless, like Tiffany said, don't contact me unless, if this is something you really need. Okay. Wow. Yeah, I like that. You like this guy? Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, you're not a bad person. Because I also don't like it either. You know, these are A's. You have apps here and there. You get notification and all those things. So you really need to know how to trim those notifications and those noises right only the ones that you want to focus so i guess he is good at that <laughs> wow 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 this is another thing like what we just talked about 표정 보소. it's the same format 보소. Traditionally speaking for me, look at this, what? 인성. That's right. 성격 is the same thing. 인성. I guess maybe I should look at the Chinese character. 인, person, 성격, personality, right? Person's personality. So think of it as character. 인성. Personality. Look at that personality. Look at that character, right? 소문보다 더해. 소문보다 더해. What's that mean? 보다. Why do you see 보다 in the middle of the sentence? Noun, 보다, and verb. 소문보다 더해. So sometimes we are not going to have 더. 소문보다 더해. So, more 하다, do, right? More do than 소문. 소문 is rumor. That's right. 소문 is rumor. Okay? This is than. Okay? So, he does more than the rumor. As in, he's worse than the rumor because at the school, people are talking behind him saying that, oh, he's handsome and he's the first place for the, you know, study. He's so smart, smartest person in school, but personality is so terrible, right? But she's realizing, oh, he does more than, as in, worse than the rumor. Uh, did I miss 우시 열받아? Maybe the next part. Talang! So she's back to the comic book store. Equivalent blockbuster. Talang! This is a bell doorbell sound. 우시 열받아. 식, 식. 오늘은 제 잔인한 걸 봐줘야겠어. So she's always upset in comic book stores since. <laughs> 우시. I guess the same day. 열받아. This is like a good expression. Have you heard 열받아? 받다 and 열. 열받다. So they use together 열받다. 받다. So the verb here is 받다. Get or receive. 열 is Fever or heat, right? But this means I'm fuming. 열받아. Oh, 
I'm angry, right? 열 받아. Mm-hmm. Shik shik. This like her fuming is coming out. Shik shik. Right? Blood pressure is high. Yeah. <laughs> 오늘은. So this is like S4, I think. S4 today. Today. I don't know about other days. But today I'm very angry. As for today, 제일 잔인한 걸 봐줘야겠어. Okay? 잔인한 걸 제일 most 잔인하다 걸 describing 걸 right? 잔인하다. 그 so that becomes an adjective. 잔인하다. To be cruel. Okay? Or to be kind of gory. 잔인해. Violent. Okay? Cruel thing. In this case, thing as in, she's in comic book store. She wants to pick a comic book. So the comic book, that's cruel. The most cruel. 봐줘야겠어. 보다 플러스 주다. 봐주다. So 주다 here in this case, it's not give. It means favor, right? Favor for the verb. So she's favoring for herself. Oh, I'm so angry. I should watch, I should read or see. The most cruel comic book for myself, right? So she's treating herself by reading cruel books. 봐주다. Okay? Yeah, here. Have to get will. So think of this as rhetorical should. I should. 그래야겠어. I should be like that. 봐줘야겠어. I should read. Most cruel as for today. Okay? So she wants to pick up something cruel. Now next. Oh, uh, yoga uh, bulka? Did I miss something? Oh, here, uh, below. I missed that. 언니랑 같이 왔으면 성의 인증까지 딱인데. 아쉽군. 언니랑 같이 왔으면 So she's got 언니 Right? So when you see the word 언니 We know she has older sister Because 언니 is older sister Called by younger sister 언니 랑 같이 왔으면 랑랑 랑. This, this is the particle they used after vowel. 언니랑. By cross, she means her. Or maybe. It could be her or gory, things like that. With, together. Together with older sister. 왔으면. 오다, past tense, 으면. This is a conjunction, right? 오다. Past tense, 왔으면. That's right. If I came with my sister together, what will happen? 성의 인증까지 딱인데. 성의 인증까지. This noun까지. Until, up to, or even. Depends on the context. Okay? Or even this, including this, 성인 인증. So she is actually not an adult by official number, I guess. She's still in, is she in high school? But that's weird. I thought she's in college right now. Is she not? Maybe I'm getting mixed up. Anyway, it seems like she cannot get 18. Plus, yeah. 
성인 인증까지. 인증 is like also confirmation, security confirmation. This is ID check, right? So adult ID check, even. 딱인데. 딱인데. 딱 is the sound that I just snapped. 딱. It's like perfect. It will be perfect. 딱이다. 인데, but. 아쉽군. 군, this is a verb ending. And this is a verb 아쉽다. Do you remember what I mentioned before? 아쉽다. I went back in time for a backstory. Oh, what a shame. I see. 완벽한데, 딱인데, that's right. So normally, 아쉽다 is interpreted as what a shame. So well, what a shame can be applied in many different contexts in English, right? So this is more like what a shame for missing out on opportunity. Ah, oh, I should have come with my sister I'm missing out the opportunity. You know, I could get the 18 plus rated comic books. Mm -hmm. So, she's saying, Oh, 요거 볼까? Oh, 있다. 요거 is the same thing as 이거. Okay? So, they put 요거, even though it's 이거. You know, that's generally people will say 요거 very casually too, even in speaking format, not just about webtoon, 요거, 이거. 이거 볼까? 인문달 씨 반갑습니다. Welcome. 볼까? 알까 verb ending 보다 and 알까? 어 uh, just as much. 음. I'm not sure it's like just as much, but you're gonna probably see commonly enough. 이거 해, 요거 해. They're all the same thing. 네, 반갑습니다. 보다 with 알까. This is rhetorical question. Oh, should I? Should I read this thing? 이거 볼까? Oh, oh wait. Oh, 있다. Oh, there it is. There it is, right? Oh my god, of course, he's right there. Oh, 뭐야? Ah, 뭐야, yeah. I read it. 뭐야, yeah. 만화집방 출근한 것도 아니고. 뭐야, yeah. 뭐야. So, this is what and be verb, but this is more like expression. 뭐야. Right? We've gone through this expression. What the? What the hell? Yeah, this guy. What the, this guy, right? 만화책방. 출근하는 것도 아니고. 만화책방. So this is all compound nouns. 만화책방. Cartoon or comic, book. This is room. But we interpret it as store. Comic book store. 출근하는 것도 아니고 출근하다 verb adjective describing 거 것도 아니고 okay go verb ending 도 so what all this 출근하다 verb look up this verb 출근하다 요즘 저는 출근 안 해요. I don't commute. 왜냐하면 집에서 일해요. I work from home. 출근하다 is commute. Okay? Go to work. Commute. So, things that commute. Right? As in commuting. 도, 도 has meaning of also or even. In this context, might be better with even. So, 아니다 is to be not. 
So think of it as it's not even that you commute to Chekbang, right? It's not even that you commute to comic book stores, as in you are here all the time. It's like you're working here. It's like you're working here. Every time I come here, you're here. Tanida is uh, also go somewhere as a repetition. Not necessary. It's only about commuting. 출근하다 is literally associated to going to work. Commute to work. Tanida is more broad. Okay? So... It's not even that he commutes to uh, Manek Chekbang. And she's saying, Oh, 네가 할 말은 아닌 듯. 네가 할 말은 아닌 듯. She's talking to herself. 네가, 네가 할 말은 아닌 듯. You. 할 말. What's that? 할 말은 아닌 듯. And so it's the same verb 아니다 to be not and this is as if it seems like okay it seems like or as if it's not like he has something to say oh so chibi in this case She's actually talking to herself. You. So it's not, it seems like it's not something you should say, you say. Because she's also here all the time. So she's talking to herself, thinking, oh, why are you always here? It's not like you're working here. But she's also talking to herself, saying, oh, it's not in your position to say that. It's not. Something you say because I'm also here too. <laughs> I know it can be a little confusing. Oh, he's talking to her. Oh, 저 그때 추천해 준 사토무 작가 작품 재밌더라고요. 네? 저 그때 추천해 준. So she recommended him a book last time, right? 저 저 as in like, hey, uh, excuse me, 저 like starting to have some conversation. That's right. She she'll be hypocritic. 그때 추천해 준. This is adjective describing what comes after. 추천해 준 사토무 작가 작품. So the verb here is 추천해 주다. So as you know, Juda with conjugated verb root meaning favor, right? So this is the main verb, 추천하다. Okay? So if you look up this verb, 추천하다. 추천하다 to recommend. Oh, the 사토무 작가, the author work that you recommended me. At that time, mm -hmm. the book you recommended me at the time. Oh, the book was what? 재밌더라고요. The verb here, 재미있다, 더라고요. 더라고 is all ending. Yo is verb, just polite ending. 더라. We learned this one before in other streaming. This. Uh, is more like I noticed. Okay? I noticed that what? I noticed that 재미있다. The book was 재미있었어요. He recognized her without makeup. No! So at that time she recommended him the book she was in the comic book store, so she didn't wear makeup. So she's, uh, he's thinking, 
the same girl without makeup. At the time, she recommended him the comic book. But he may not recognize her at school because she's wearing makeup. Mm-hmm. Two different people. So, 재미있다. Fun exists. Fun exists. Meaning, to be interesting. Oh, I see. That's why I see you got confused. You didn't catch up, I see. Oh, the author Satomu work that you recommended me at the time was interesting that I noticed. Wow. So, and then she's all going full, full uh, explanation now. A uh, 하루 만에 다 읽었어요. Oh, where is that? 하루 만에 다 읽었어요? I missed that. 하루 만에 다 읽었어요. That's what he's saying. 하루 만에 다 읽었어요. 하루 만에 다 읽었어요. So, 만 has a different meaning too. 만. 만 only or 10,000. Right? In this case, within. 하루 만에. Within what? Within a day, I read everything. Mm -hmm. So, 읽다 verb. This is the verb 읽다. I read all with one day. That's right. And then she's going full explanation. Oh, 그쵸, 그쵸. 그쵸 is the same thing as 그렇죠. So she's excited. That's why she's repeating the same now. The same uh, word. 그렇지. Is that right? Is that right? 이토준지 만화 좋아하면 당연히 치즈일 줄 알았어요. 이토준지 만화 좋아하면 same conjunction we gone through 당연히 치즈일 줄 알았어요. So this is the main verb here. So as you know, 치즈 they made a reference here. It's the same thing as 취향 저격. Okay? So, 취저, I guess uh, this syllable and this syllable, and then they made a new noun. 취저. So, 이토준지 만화 좋아하면. So, this is the comic book that he grabbed the very first time they met. Do you remember episode 1, I think? Was it 1 or 2? They met for the first time in comic book store. She was going to grab something and he snatched it, right? I'm going to read this, right? 이토준지 만화 comic book 좋아하면 Hey, Paolo! Thank you so much for joining the live streaming. We have a couple more scripts to go through. So, 좋아하다 ver. So, this verb needs an object. Okay? I also made a video about this 좋아하다 and 좋다 difference. If you want to check that out, and please do so. 좋아하다 needs an object. So, if you like this type of comic, if you like it, 당연히, of course. This is more like adverb, of course. 당연히 취저일 줄 알았어요. 취저 이 답을 알줄 알다. So we've gone through this one before. Normally it's used with 알다 main verb or 모르다 as an object. If I looked it up, 줄 this one 
apparently has meaning of way or method. So you don't have to think of it this way directly, but just remember that Aida and Moruda verse normally associate to this object now, Jul. Okay? I guess it's used together like grammar rule. So I knew, I knew that what? You, you is omitted. You will be, you will be, 취정, 취향적역. So two nouns are combined. Two nouns. 취향, preference, 적역. This is like perfect match. 취향적역. In neighbor, it says preference should. So 적역하다, this is also should. But meaning in this case, 취향적역, perfect match. Oh, if you like this type of comic, of course, I knew it would be, meaning you would be this type. So meaning the book that I recommended, I knew you're going to like it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. You can also think of it as how to do something. But in this case, maybe how doesn't work. 취향 저격 Be your preferred Preference Preference Should Preference should As in perfect match Think of it 몇개또 추천해 줄까요? 몇 개? So this K This is counting unit for general object but this is more like books that they are recommending. So they could have used Kwon. Myeok Kwon. Kwon is counting unit for books. K is counting unit for general objects. Myeok Ge, Myeok Kwon, either is fine in this context. Myeok Ge to 추천해 줄까요? To 추천해 주다 알까요? Okay, so 추천하다 we've gone through. This is a verb. 추천하다 recommend, right? So 줄까요? Should I recommend you as a favor? Again, a, a bit more books. 몇 개? Couple more books. Okay. So should I recommend you a couple more books? Think of it like that. 제가 그쪽에선 좀 바삭해서 어쩌고 저쩌고 <웃음> 제가 그쪽으로는 좀 바삭해서 This is an expression. 제가 This is 저 plus 가 right? 저 plus subject particle 제가 I 그쪽으로는 그쪽으로 with as for as for that what 그쪽 that area that side so 그쪽으로 as for that side as in uh, 이토준지 mana type that kind of type direction that's right 그쪽 the side right as for that area 좀 a bit 바삭해서 so the verb here is 바삭하다 conjugated with 서. This is a good expression. 바삭하다. 어, 제가 그쪽으로는 좀 바삭해요. I am what? Knowledgeable. I'm an expert almost. I'm knowledgeable. I know inside out. Think of it as know inside out. I'm very knowledgeable a bit in that area. As for that side, as in, in that area, 어쩌고 저쩌고. This is, uh, think of it as blah blah. Okay? 어쩌고 저쩌고. 어쩌고 저쩌고 하다. Blah blah do. 어쩌고 저쩌고. So she's just talking. Okay? Understand here? So now, 
We're gonna move on to number seven script. Here. So she's looking at the book and you know, 이거는 어쩌고 저쩌고 again this blah 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 explaining him. And then 요거는 again 요거 is same thing as 이거. 이거는 달랑 the doorbell. I guess they're walking out together. Oh, oh my. Oh, 아 그리고 제가 추천한 블로그 꼭 들어가 보세요. 거기 진짜 공포자료 짱 많아요. As if they had a long conversation. So that's what they're saying. 이거는 this blah blah blah, right? This blah blah. Again, the same thing. Yo is the same thing as 이. 아 그리고. 아 그리고. This is a conjunction. Starting of a new sentence. 그리고. And, right? And what? 아 그리고 제가 제가 I 추천한 the verb 추천하다 describing blog. Wow, they talked about blog too. Blog, the same thing as blog. Okay, 꼭 들어가 보세요. 들어가 보다. Okay, the verb here is 들어. 가, 다, 플러스, 보다. Even though this one may look like it's not conjugated, but 가, when it's conjugated, it's the same format, 가, right? 가, 다 becomes 가요, right? So without 요, 들어가, 보세요. So when 보다 verb is used with another verb, it means what? When 보다 is used with another verb, it means try. That's right. Try to 들어가, enter. In English, people will say, check it out. Check out my YouTube or check out my blog or check out what? In this case, blog that I recommend. Blog that I recommended. So, 들어가다, it means to enter, okay, 들어가, enter, but in English, you may be interpreted as check it out, okay, 블로그에 들어가 보세요, oh, go in there, as in go into the online and check it out, 거기 진짜 공포자료 짱 많아요, 거기, there, the blog, 진짜, 공포 자료 짱 많아요. 자료 짱 많아요. So this is all adverb. 진짜 and 짱. So they're pretty much the same thing. But 짱 is more like slang. Okay? Young people will say 짱. 짱이야. Okay, it could be 너가 짱이야. You're the best. You're the best. Right? 짱. Or it could be in this case very. No, 짱 많아요. Really, very. So it's almost like repetition. 진짜 is also very and really. 진짜 짱 많아요. Almost like emphasis of how many there are. 따봉. 따봉. <laughs> that's, that's funny. How do you know 따봉? <laughs> I actually don't see anyone using 따봉 these days. That was like my parents' generation of jang. <laughs> so manta verb. Manta becomes manao. To be a lot. So what is a lot? Kungpo jaru. So this is a noun plus noun. What's that? What do you think she's gonna say? Kungpo jaru? Jang manao. There are a lot of 공포 자료. 자료 is material. Okay? 공포. Horror. 
horror materials. They like gory, uh, gory. Is it gory? Gory things or scary things. Okay, 공포 영화, horror movies. Okay, 아 그래요, Tiffany. <laughs> so there are a lot of 공포 horror materials on that blog. 거기, right? So I think this is the word that Nikki asked yesterday. 그럼 이만. So 그럼 이만. Uh, bye for now, right? 그럼 in that case 이만. Stop here, right? 이만. 그럼 이만. Bye for now. Okay. But what's gonna happen? 잠깐만요. 오. 저기. 잠깐만요. Hey, wait a minute. He has something else to say. Wow. Very different. 잠깐. 잠깐만. Like we talked about, it's the same thing as 잠깐. 만 means only. Okay. 잠깐 means little or while. Okay. Small. Um, range of time, right? 잠깐, 만. Only a little bit, as in, wait a minute, 잠깐만요. So, oh, 저 그게, 그, 그게, so he wants to say something. Look at his face. He's got some blushes on his cheeks, right? Oh, 저 그게, hey there, the thing is, 그게, right? 만화 추천해 줘서 고맙다고요. <웃음> 만화, 만화, the comic book, right? 추천해 주셔서. Okay, conjugated verb root 서. This is conjunction, right? 고맙다 고요. This is the same thing as 고. 고맙다고요, right? But normally Koreans will say 구, 우, 바, when it's actually 오. It's easier to say 우. 고맙다고요. 추천해 주다. We talked about 추천하다 plus 주다 plus she. She is making the verb polite. Now he's talking to her in polite, right? So I actually... Earlier when he asked about her, you know, the book was very interesting. I think he used polite speech. 추천해 주셔서 Oh, because you recommended me. Me is missing. Because you recommended as a favor, right? Favor. 고맙다. This is thank you. To be thankful. 고맙다. 고맙다고요. So think of it as I'm saying. So he's not even directly saying 고마워요. 추천해 주셔서 고마워요. He doesn't want to say it directly. I'm just saying thank you for recommending the book. Okay? 고맙다고요. I'm just saying. I'm saying. Thank you for recommending me the book. Ha ha ha! What's going on? So this is a two sides of him. The first one, the left side, this is an angry man at school. Oh, 연락하지 마. Don't contact me. Now he's got some, you know, blushes and the background is a pink, you know. So two different faces. So she cannot believe it. 뭐야? 오늘 학교에서 본 그놈이랑 같은 놈 맞는 거냐고. 뭐야? What the? Right? What the? 오늘. 오늘 학교에서. 오늘. Today. Right? Today. 학교. They were at school earlier. Right? 네, 학교에서 location particle at school 본 그놈이랑 본 
This is the verb 보다 becomes an adjective describing 근호. So this is past tense adjective. The guy, 근호 means the guy. The guy that I saw at school today. 오늘 학교에서 본 근호미랑 This could be with or in this context might be as. So I'm gonna explain why. 같은 So this is the verb 같다 To be same. In English, people will say same as. The guy is same as another guy, right? So in this case, Based on the English grammar, you're going to probably interpret it as as. Okay? 같은 놈. Describing 놈. The guy. Right? Same as the guy. <laughs> so there are two guys. The guy, same as the guy that I saw at school today. So this is, is this the guy? Right? 맞는 거냐고. 맞다 verb adjective describing 거. So the verb here is 맞다. And 거냐구. So 냐고 we talked about it before. In this case, might be a little different. Normally, is are you asking? Right? Are you asking? Or yesterday it was more like surprise type thing. Why necessary it has to be this way, right? But in this case, is this even? You can interpret it as is this even? Is this guy, right? Is this guy even? To be right. Is this guy even the same? Uh, is this guy right? Let me let me say. Uh, is this guy right? Same as the guy. Is this guy right? Who is same as the guy that I saw at school today? Is this the same guy as the? I mean, in English, is this even the same guy? Oh, I think it, it, is this even the same guy as the guy that I saw at school today? Maybe that's that's good. Is this the right guy? Mm-hmm. Is this even the same guy I saw at school today? Yeah, yeah. I think we all get the same idea. <laughs> Alright, so this one was the last sentence of this webtoon episode 7. So I probably continue this webtoon series on the weekend. And uh, like I mentioned yesterday, Monday and Thursday, I'm going to start uploading short videos instead of live streaming. So Monday and Thursday, it's more like the summary for grammar and phrases and words, things like that for more of the beginners and intermediate or even advanced if they want to have some refreshed uh, knowledge that's great so live streaming is a little more complicated somehow right so i'm gonna uh devote it monday and thursday for non-advanced people too i guess it's generally for everyone so tomorrow there is not gonna be a live streaming but you will see my pre-recorded video at noon Eastern time. And Tuesday, I see you at 4 p.m. Eastern time. Okay? So hopefully you enjoyed this live stream. If you did, make sure to give thumbs up. What you can do is share this video with your friends and family so that we can grow this community together. Thank you so much for joining the live streaming. Hopefully you have enjoyed. Enjoy great weekend. The rest of the weekend. See you next time on Tuesday. Bye bye.